Okay, so Age of Ultron, we just come out the first screen. We got Day and Andy from Heroes for Sale. What were your thoughts? I thought it was really well paced, pieced together. I like, I find it strange how they changed Ultron's character, but they've done it well. It fits the theme. You're saying it's not quite, he's been taken away, he's less of a cold robot. In, in the comics, he's, he is a clinical robot. Just bent on destroying humanity. In this, he's got that Tony Stark edge, which I thought was quite to make it a little bit more accessible, isn't it? Because there's a lot of quips through all these Avengers movies, and to have him making them as well just gives you that little edge. Yeah, I think they've kind of looked at the Loki mold yeah. and gone out and remake a robot Loki, but not in a cheap way. It, it, it works. It was really good, wasn't it? It was really good. All of it was boss. I think for me it was good without making any spoilers. It was Hawkeye. Hawkeye really shone yeah, yeah. in the film. He had a great sense of humour as well, didn't he? Yeah. I wasn't really expecting. From the first film, I didn't really think much of Hawkeye. Yeah, but this film's definitely changed my opinion. Yeah. Quicksilver and Star Wars, that was a nice little addition. Yeah. Chemistry I, I, going on. I like the, the changes that we see throughout the film, not to spoil anything. I, I like the changes that we see. Um, basically building on things, isn't it? Anticipating a few other things. Yeah. And then, and then the big credits thing was also a, a particular special moment. Yeah, so, it's yeah. Three, Have you got three words to sum up the whole movie, Dave? Vision is awesome. Vision is awesome. There we are. We have it. Don't see Age of Ultron. It's out now.